The kit consists of the four stretcher bars, industrial strength corner clip, hanging kit, four corner braces, some glue, and a push pin. We use a push pin and we push it through the very corner of the image, like so. Then we flip the image and we put a little X where that hole came through. And we do that on all four corners. We flip the canvas over, we have our four X's, and we're now going to draw lines to locate the stretcher bars on the back of the canvas. So I put a, a ruler on here which is two inches wide, and I'm going to draw a series of lines between those X's where we're going to place the stretcher bars. We've drawn our X's and we've drawn lines which are two inches in from a line drawn through those X's and we've created in effect an area where the image is only we see the back of the canvas and we're going to remove the double sided tape on the back of the stretcher bar pull it off like so and place the bar down between the lines that we drew I'm going to place the bar down at an angle like this so we can push it back and forth just a little bit and just expose this line here and make sure your bar is in between and press it down on the canvas. When you put down the stretcher bars you put the slanted side toward the inside of the canvas and this stapling ledger on the outside. Put them right between the lines. So we're going to draw a line across this corner approximately three-eighths of an inch from this corner right here and here. Then we're going to cut across here like so. It's important to have a nice cut mat under here. And then we're going to cut this like so and fold these tabs up so they stick to the double-sided tape that's in the gap. We just simply fold these up like so and take the corner clip and insert it into the corner and that becomes a clamp holding the 45 degree together. together. Next thing you do is just tap that in, finish it off with the hammer. We're now stapling the canvas on the back and using our stapling ledger to push the stapler up against it to make a nice tight stretch on the return. We simply start in the middle and work our way to the corners. The final staples go right in the corner like so by pushing the stapler right up against the edge and then pulling in the final staple and then put a saddle staple across the back. The last step in stapling is to trim the excess canvas from the back. We're going to insert our corner braces. The corner braces are simply pushed into these channels in the back and they're used to stabilize the corner. Just tap these corner braces in. The final stretch, as you can see, is very neat, tidy, and professional looking. And on the front, you can see that it's nice and tight, just like a drum. From StretcherBarDepot.com